Hi guys, good day. It's me, Teacher MJ. Our topic for today class, it's all about how to draw triangles with given three sides using the compass and the ruler. So without further ado, let's do this topic. So we will have two examples class for you to really understand this one. So let's start with example number one. So we have given 7 centimeters, 5 centimeters, and 3 centimeters. Now first thing that you need to do class is you draw a horizontal line that is 7 centimeters. So you always draw the longest line, 7 centimeters. Alright, so 7 centimeters. Alright, so next step class, you need to measure 5 centimeters in this particular ruler than using your compass because we need to draw an arc. Okay, once again, we need to measure 5 centimeters. So you put your needle here from your compass and then 5 centimeters, so this one. Alright, so I hope you got that one, class. That is 5 centimeters. Okay, you can adjust your compass. So, this one and then this one. So, 5 centimeters. Alright, so that's it. 5 centimeters. And then, from this point, class, this first point, once again, let's try to measure again if this is 5 centimeters. Yep, that's 5 centimeters. Now, from this point, class, you put your needle in this point, in this first point, and then you draw an arc, class. Using your compass, simply draw an arc. Alright, so that is the first arc. Now, next step, class, is you need to measure 3 centimeters using your compass again. Alright, 3 centimeters. So, you put your needle here, and then 3 centimeters. Alright, so that's it, 3 centimeters. And then you put your needle class on the second point, and then you draw the you draw an arc class. Okay, put the needle here on the second point, and then simply draw an arc. So this intersection class, this will be our third point. Okay, this will be the third point, and this will be the thing that we need to connect. From this point to this point, that would be your second side. From this point to this point, that would be your third side. So, we connect this one. Of course, this will be 5 cm for the second side. And then 3 cm for the third side. Alright, so third side is 3 cm. That's it, class. All set. So, that's how you draw triangles given 3 sides. So, we can just simply erase this arc. Okay, this guide. Okay, we can sketch this one with a ball pen to finalize our answer. So, let's sketch this one, class, with a ball pen to finalize our answer. Alright, so... So, let's measure it again. 7 centimeter. yep. 7 centimeter. So, 7 centimeter, and this, this is 3 centimeter, right? Yep, 3 centimeter. So, 3 centimeter, and this will be 5 centimeters. Yep, 5 centimeters. That's it, class. All set. So, that's how you draw with given three sides. So, let's have example number 2 for this one, class. For you to really understand this one, given three sides. So example number 2. So, we have given AB 8 centimeters. And we have given side AC 6 centimeters. Side BC, that is 4 centimeters. Once again, first step, you draw horizontal line, the longest side, that is 8 centimeters. So we have side AB. So 8 centimeters for side AB. Alright, so from this point, so this is point A and then point B. So we have side AB. So A to B. Alright, and that is 8 centimeters. So let's label this one 8 centimeters. Alright, and then you measure class in your compass 6 centimeters. So 6 centimeters. So you put your needle here and then 6 centimeters. So 6 centimeters. So 6 centimeters. Yup, that is 6 centimeters. Alright, so I hope you see this one class. So let's measure again. Let's have this one. Yep, 6 centimeters. So from this point class, 
the first point, you put your needle here, and then you draw an arc plus. Okay, draw an arc. And then you measure again your compass, 4 centimeters. Right, so 4 centimeters. So, let's measure this one, 4 centimeters. Right, so 4 centimeters. Yup, this is 4 centimeters. I hope you see this one, class. Okay, 4 centimeters. Yup, this is 4 centimeters. Alright, so, you put your needle here on the second point, and then you draw an arc that is 4 centimeters. And this intersection, class, this will be our point C. So, this will be our point C. Alright, and then simply connect, class. So, let's check if this is 6 centimeters. Yup, 6 centimeters. Exactly 6 centimeters. So, we can sketch this one with a ball pen. 6 centimeters to finalize our answer. And this is 8 centimeters, right? A while ago. So, 8 centimeters. And this will be 4 centimeters for side BC. Alright, let's measure that one. If this is really 4 centimeters, yep, exactly 4 centimeters, class. Alright, exactly 4 centimeters. Alright, we can label this one. So this is point A, angle A, angle B, angle C. Alright, and this is 8 centimeters for AB and CB. Let's measure it again. CB, that's 4 centimeters, yep, 4 centimeters. Or BC, 4 centimeters. AC, that is 6 centimeters. Let's measure it again. Yep, 6 centimeters. And AB, that's 8 centimeters. All set, class. So you can just simply erase this one. Alright, erase the guide. That's it, class. All set. So that's how you draw triangles given three sides using the compass and the ruler. So I hope you learned something new today. If you like this video, do not forget to like, share, and subscribe. You share it to your friends and to your classmates so that we can help more students. Once again, this is Teacher MJ. You have a great day, class. Goodbye for now. Bye-bye.